Welcome to Solar Work T Tips by NC CATCAM Systems. Today we'll be discussing how to replace a component inside an assembly or in drawing. The assembly that we'll be looking at today is a medical couch. We will be replacing the couch subassembly with different diameter side rails. There are two ways to replace this component. One is within the drawing um, in SolarWorks. Uh, the other method is to do it in the open file interface. First, let's start with replacing this file in our assembly uh, interface. First, we can click onto our site rails, and in our feature tree, it will indicate which sub-assembly or which part um, the site rail is in. And for our assembly, the site rails are located in the couch sub-assembly. Therefore, we're going to replace this sub-assembly by right-clicking, clicking, clicking uh, the double arrows, and we go on to replace components. This blue highlighted area um, shows the component that's about to be replaced and we can select whether all instances are replaced or just a single instance. And for our case, it doesn't make a difference as it's just one couch subassembly. However, if you were to replace uh, the side rails on its own, you can untick this all instance to replace just one side rail. We then go on to browse to look for our um, other subassembly. And for us, it's the couch design to subassembly. In here we have the configuration option. We can match the name with um, the new part and if the name is different you can manually select um, the configurations and you can also have the option to reattach mates. In this window it shows the mates that were um, transferred onto the new file. Green text shows that um, they've been transferred successfully. If they are shown in a red cross, you can then use this uh, interface down the bottom to um, reattach um, the mates with the new model or with the new component. You can select the component, flip mates alignment and show the preview. The next method that we'll look at is to replace the couch subassembly by using the open um, file interface. Let's close this assembly first. In this window we can look for filter out all the parts and just look at the assembly. In here we can see our medical couch and by clicking onto reference we can locate um, the couch uh, sub-assembly and in here we can see our old or our couch design to sub-assembly. We then double click onto it and we can find our components to replace it with. We cl then click back onto the couch, this was the original um, sub-assembly. Open. You can see that the component that's replaced will be shown in green. Then click OK. And open. You must then rebuild this model in order to um, show the new component. And there you have it. Next, I'll show you how you can do the same thing with a design drawing. For example, I may have a side rail um, design drawing shown here. This is for the smaller diameter side rail, and if I were to replace it with the larger um, Radi uh, 
side rail. We can then open up the side rail design drawing again. Click onto reference and change our uh, reference to our side rail large. Then click OK. And it will show the side rail in the larger diameter. Thank you for watching SolarWorks Quick Tips by NC CAD CAM Systems.